This is Susan Bush with SGTV. After three long years and just in time for summer, we are excited to announce Hank Pitcher's new exhibition, Tidal Force. Just as the tide comes in and goes out, and just as the seasons turn, Hank Pitcher continues to paint. He continues to explore the California coast as he has for over 40 years, looking for new images and new ideas about life in our time and place. Earlier this week, we recorded a conversation between Hank and Frank Goss, his dealer for over a decade. And so the job of a landscape painter is to go out there and see what there is to see and, and talk about it. And then it's the public's choice or ideas to decide that, you know, that, that people look like Lucian Freud paints them or people look like Vargas paints yeah. them or people yeah. look like Alice Neal paints them. Who are we? I mean, I think that the job, I think that what artists do is that they discover and at the same time to, de to develop an image of who we are. He pushes his paint around his canvases and pulls it across their surface. Like the ocean currents that help create our weather and waves, Hank's warm colors move against his cool colors, seeking an elegant and everlasting balance. It is purely elemental stuff. You can look at that. You can look at that ocean and say it's dirty, that's polluted, or that kelp is smelly and there's flies on it. Or you can look at it and say, well, isn't that shape? Doesn't that shape echo the shape of the island? You know, or that shape echoes the shape of the bird, and it becomes like poetry. You know, it becomes some, this. This shape rhymes with that shape. So you can see that either as a piece of rotten kelp, or you can see it as a shape that's in harmony. His approach is marked by commitment, sincerity, and a very California kind of cool. We can trace his lineage back to both Fairfield Porter and Paul George on the East Coast, and to late Bay Area figurative painting on the West Coast. But Hank has evolved and refined his own distinctive style over years of experimentation and articulation. He is first and foremost a painter, a passionate lover of the craft and tradition of image making in oil. All the time, I think about that, and I'll, I'll, you know, I'll, I'll make that stroke on the sand of that shadow, and then I'll, if it's not right, and I'll wipe it off, and I'll do it again, and I'll wipe it off, and I'll do it again, and I'll wipe, clear the whole painting off until, until that stroke is the right stroke. And Ready after three long years, Tidal Force will remind you once again why Hank is one of California's and especially Santa Barbara's most beloved and admired painters. I mean. Sometimes I'll make a painting and I'll think that it's just a perfectly successful or I'll think that it's a failure and then I'll look at it later on and I and I'll think the opposite. Go the other way. And it's oh, often interesting. it's often the paintings that I think are the best later on I think are the worst and vice versa. Huh. And that's why I like to have them in the studio for a while and I like to pick at them. Make fine art a part of your life. Hank Pitcher, Tidal Force will be on display from June 2nd through August 28th 2011.